And we're here again. Kuchinawa, please don't drag them into this. Oh, fuck off, Windows. I'm the one you despise, right? Then I'm the only one you need to kill. Is that gonna sit on my screen the entire fucking time? <laughs> God damn it. Yes, and the recording is gonna pick it up. Yeah, it is. So hold on, we gotta pause this. Alright, now that Windows bullshit's done. <laughs> I'm the one you just found right? Okay, yeah. Sheena, stop talking like that. It's okay. Kuchinawa, please. Fine. Oh no! <laughs> Laser from the moon! You gotta be kidding me! Enough of this, Sheena! No! Lloyd, come on! Everybody, into the gate! You gotta love how Mythos doesn't have a running animation. No, nope, he just walks. <laughs> Damn! The Guardian signature trail disappeared. They've escaped into Silverant. <laughs> Where are we? Probably on the outskirts of Palma Costa. We're back in Silverant? The mana level seems to have risen, but it's definitely Silverant. Oh, man. I never thought I'd wind up coming over to this side like that. Zealous, why did you butt in? Excuse me? Don't tell me you actually wanted to die back there. Well... Besides, those guys would have come after us regardless of whether or not you died. Pope's orders and all. Are you saying Kuchinawa is working for the Pope? It's likely. Those assassins he had with him were the Pope's men, weren't they? I'm certain of it. Sheena, please don't do something like that again. Don't make the same mistakes I did. Nothing good will come of you sacrificing your life. Colette's absolutely right. You should thank Zello, Sheena. Th thanks. Come on now. Would it hurt you to give me a kiss or two? Zelos, you're horrible. Ooh, ouch. But what are we gonna do now? Well, since we're back in Silverunt, why don't we find out what the designs are up to? What about Mythos? We can't drag him into this. Maybe we could ask the Pomacosa government to take care of him for a while. Neil, huh? Hmm. I guess that's a good idea. I want to fight, too. What are you saying? This journey is dangerous even if you had an X-Sphere. He's right, Mythos. We do appreciate your sentiment, though. I suppose you're right. I understand. Blech. Traitors. It's not like you to mope around. I'm certainly not looking for you to cheer me up. There you go, that's the spirit. That Kuchinawa. Oh well, don't give him too hard of a time. Just leave me alone, I hate traitors more than anything is. Be. Oh, scary, scary. There's nothing worse than a hysteric woman. <gasps> Would you please leave me alone? You should stop and consider who betrayed whom first, don't you think? What did you just say? Uh-oh, retreat, retreat. Bleh. I... Bleh. Okay. I guess we'll go to Pamela Costa first. Because none of the monsters here are even worth fighting, we'll just one-shot them all. Yeah. Chosen one, Lloyd, how is the journey to release the seals going? Ah, uh, well, actually, uh, everything's going well. Anyway, we were wondering if you would take care of him for a while. Hmm, I certainly don't mind, but who is he? He's traveling with us for the moment, but we're heading to an area that is too dangerous for him. Are you heading to the Palma Costa Ranch? What? What are you talking about? That was destroyed. Oh, you're not? We've recently received reports that designs are wandering inside the ruins of the ranch. We've increased our security. 
I wonder if Magnus came back. I don't know if it's related, but there are also reports that designs are attacking the sea route between Azuld and Palmacosta. They seem to be constructing some sort of giant infrastructure on the ocean floor. The remote island human ranch is located in that region. I wonder what's going on over there. Maybe it's the mana cannon that Rodile is building. Well, if you're worried about it, why don't we go take a look? Even if it's not the mana cannon, this city will become the next Luin if the Palmacosta Ranch is operational again. Yeah, let's check out the Palmacosta Ranch. Well, it seems our plans are set. We'll come back for Mythos later. I see, I understand. Phoenix, be careful, and Rain and Lloyd and everyone else, too. Yeah, just wait here for a little while. Is that okay, Mythos? Sure. Genius, please take this with you. What's this? It's a memento of my sister who passed away. I can't take that. <gasps> if you find yourself in danger, play it. I don't know what it can do, but it may just be able to save you. Okay, thank you. I promise I'll come back and return it to you. Beep, beep, beep. Mythos is penpipe. Take care. We'll take good care of him. Please be careful. Okay, goodbye, everybody. Eh. As I get stuck on everything again. Hmm. Okay. Do we ever name this dog? Any... Yes. Pepe. <laughs> you don't think there's any what? I don't think there's anything worth buying here. No, probably not. Maybe at the grade shop we can buy, like, I don't know, like, silver and stuff, but... Wasn't there that shop back here? I wonder if they're open yet. Oh, yeah! That shop. The hidden shop. Yeah. Super secret sneaky shop. I'm impressed you were able to find where my source closed. God damn it. Fine. <laughs> Customization shop. Change grade for materials. East Fang black silver is 10. Ugh, mm. Do we want to buy any or meh? I mean, we don't really need it now because we bought all that shit. Yeah, we don't need it. Okay, then let me get out of here. Let's go. Excuse me. You could stay at the inn. Is this the inn? Yeah, I think that's the end. Skipper's Haven, 200 gold. Nah, nothing. Why is it every nope. time I'm hoping for a cutscene we don't get one, and then any time I just want to fucking save it and get HP back? There's always a cutscene. You get one? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of here. Human Ranch, rebuilt. It'll be terrible if Pamlicosa's human ranch is rebuilt. Yes, they'll attack the city again and kill more innocent people. And make more X-Fears. x, -fears. x manufacture. I'd heard the stories, but human ranches are an abomination. Yeah, I don't want to see any more people killed for the sake of x -fears. Indeed. There must be no more victims like Alicia. Never again. Okay. Uh, Why are you running? I was just wondering that. <laughs> it's like, wait a minute. We can just fucking fly wherever the hell we want to go. Hockey bubbles? I wish this camera would swing faster. Okay, nothing on that one. Out this way. Ew. I don't oh, want to yeah, go there. Oh yeah, that place. <laughs> I don't want to go there. That place sucks. Ah! We'll have to go there sooner or later. This is gonna be a piece of cake. <laughs> no way! <laughs> that was just <laughs> warming up. Seaweed! Hooray! Seaweed. Oh, we got a... One grade. Nice. Nice. Again, on a journey of regeneration. I wonder if it's okay that I came back. What are you talking about all of a sudden? I mean, I just quit in the middle of the journey. Even though the people of Silverant were all cheering me on. 
It couldn't be helped. We did what we had to do. But when I got my soul back, I was so happy. I completely forgot about Silverant and just got all excited. I forgot how much the people of this world are suffering. Even the Chosen smiles when she's happy and cries when she's sad. God damn it, Rufus. You don't have to bear all the burden by yourself. And also, Colette. As long as you continue to care about the people in this world, of this world, whatever. You are the Chosen of Regeneration. At least that's what I think. Professor Rain. Tomorrow, let's start our journey again. The journey to save Silverant, to save this land. Dip, 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 dip. Yes. Bit. No. Okay, well, that's the desert. Ooh, knuckle bubble. Hee <laughs> hee. You seem happy, weirdo. You, you seem, seem happy? happy? <laughs> yeah. It might seem inconsiderate, but I'm having a lot of fun and I'm really happy. Why? Well, it's because I've made a lot of friends. You were my only friend until now, you know? Yeah, we stuck out like a sore thumb. No, I was the only one that stuck out. You were just nice and always kept me company. That's why you're my favorite person in Asalia. Oh, uh, thanks. Okay, so... Uh, this is just the desert. We're trying to find the Palma Costa Human Ranch. Oh, right. This isn't even... I got distracted this... looking for talkie bubbles. We already found this one over here. Yeah. Okay, we'll go back to Palma Costa. Yeah. Wait, wait, we're already down here. Okay, Palma Costa. And then the ranch was somewhere over this way. Yeah, I think it's the dot that's a little to the left. This one? Yeah, there it is. Palma Costa Ranch. Oh my god, it's Buddha! Renegades. So that's it. Neo and the others couldn't tell the difference between the Designs and the Renegades. We've been waiting for you. Are you saying you were expecting us to come here? Does it really matter? We have more important things to discuss, such as joining forces. Unbelievable. You actually expect us to trust you after all you've done to Lloyd and Colette? The circumstances have changed. Ewan! Do you know of the giant Carlon tree? The legendary giant tree is said to have existed in the holy ground of Carlon, right? It's the tree of life which produces infinite mana. Isn't that just a fairy tale? The giant Carlon tree indeed existed, but the Carlon war exhausted its mana supply and the tree wilted away. And now all that remains is its seed left in the holy ground of Carlon. The seed of the giant tree is in the final seal? It is known as the Great Seed. Are you talking about the soul of Mythos? Now that is a fairy tale. The Great Seed, the source of the world's mana, is the seed of the giant tree. The Great Seed is absolutely vital in order to reunite the two worlds. Reunite the two worlds? I believe I told you before, Yggdrasil is the creator of the two worlds. Originally the world was one, but Yggdrasil ripped it asunder. How is it even possible for someone to split the world apart? It was possible for Yggdrasil, the two worlds have managed to survive by vying for the small amount of mana seeping from the Great Seed. So that's why the cycle of flourishing and declining continues, and the Chosen goes on the journey of regeneration. But if the Great Seed germinates, the giant tree will be restored and the cycle will come to an end. How do we resurrect the giant tree? The Great Seed is nearly dead. We must expose it to a large amount of mana in order to save it. There's no supply of mana like that to be found anywhere in the world. Crucius's base, Daris Carlon, is a comet made from a giant mass of mana. It lies suspended in the sky high above this land. All we have to do is use that. Well, if that's true, why doesn't Yggdrasil revive the giant tree? All of Daris Carlon's mana is being given to Martell for the sake of resurrecting her. What? By using the power of a Crucius crystal, Martell's soul lives on, existing as a part of the Great Seed. If Martell awakes, the Great Seed will be absorbed into her and disappear. The reverse also holds true. In order to prevent that from happening, 
Yggdrasil protects the Great Seed with the seals of the Summon Spirits. So that's why the Renegades are trying to stop Martell's revival. Yes. We will make the Great Seed germinate. As a result, Martell will be absorbed by the Seed, and then... The giant Carlon tree will be reborn. If that happens, will the two worlds become one again? That I don't know. The only certainty is that the world will end if the Seed is lost. So, you're gonna have Miss Martell be a good little girl and disappear? Martell is already dead. If it weren't for Daris Carlin's mana, her soul would have disappeared a long time ago. Why is Yggdrasil so obsessed with Martell? That doesn't matter. What's important is that we see to it that the Great Seed germinates. Up till now, the Great Seed has been protected by the summon spirits of the declining world. The mana links. Correct. Now that the links have begun to unravel, the Great Seed's protection has weakened. Because we have been forming pacts with the summoned spirits of both worlds. Now I understand why you want us to join you. It's because we have Sheena, a summoner. Ewan, are you with Crucius, or are you with the Renegades? I am with Crucius, and I am also the leader of the Renegades. A double agent? In other words, a traitor. So, what's your decision? Okay. Lloyd, you're going to trust him? Yeah. He's revealed the fact that he is a traitor. He's putting himself on the line. That has to mean something. I'll trust him, too. You were headed towards Rhode Isle's ranch, correct? You sure know a lot about what we're doing. You have a spy watching us or something? No kidding. But either way, we have to stop that mana cannon thing before it's completed. We also have a debt to pay back to Rhode Isle. The ranch and mana cannon system should be interlinked. Disabling the control room should be our first priority. You seem to know quite a lot about them. We have a reason to infiltrate Rodile's ranch as well. We can guide you to the entrance if you like. We're teaming up, right? Of course. Please take us there. Why are you going to the ranch? We need to make preparations to fire men at the Great Seed. Oh, by the way, the Riyard Dimensional Transfer System will be offline while we make our preparations. You'll have to wait until after we infiltrate the ranch if you want to get back to Tetheala. Got it. Talk to Boda when you're ready. <laughs> I'll leave the rest to you, Boda. Understood. Well, we only got about two and a half minutes, so... Yeah, we can just go out and save it real quick. Yeah. When we come back, we can go do the mana cannon thingy. Woo! Oh, better to be deceived. Hard to believe we'd wind up working with the renegades. Yes, but don't let your guard down. We might be stabbed in the back the moment we show it to them. I see you're as untrusting as ever, Mistress Rain. I'd prefer to call it prudence. You're all too soft-hearted and quick to trust. We need at least one person with some discretion. Haha, <laughs> that's true. Lloyd does just believe everybody he meets. Bleh. What? Dwarven Vow number 18. It's better to be deceived than to deceive. Well, then I think I'll try deceiving Lloyd here next time. Zealous. Yes. If you betray Lloyd, your life is forfeit. <laughs> uh, it was just a joke. Don't take it seriously. I think. Okay. All right. Well, Anyways. Can... System, save. Boop. Yeah, well, considering we have a minute now, so... Yeah! I'm gonna fly... All right. What's this? Oh, wait, that's just the stupid geyser thing. Yeah. Can we even land there? I don't think so. Oh, no, we can. Oh! Neat! Too bad we don't need to go there anymore. What's over here? We've got a minute. I'm just gonna fly around. Little island. You might be able to land on it. Ooh, tucky bow. Oh. Zillas, do you have a sick? Hmm, what is it, bud? If you have a question, I'll answer it for Hunter Gald. Never mind. I'll pay you when I get rich. I'll pay you. Yeah. Uh, you're going to get rich? That's not the point. Anyway, what do I need to do to attract girls? Uh huh, you want to get chicks? I didn't think about it before, but during this journey, people mentioned how cool everyone else is, so I thought maybe I'm not. So before you thought you were the man? I thought I was cool. Lloyd, I just gained new respect for you. And that's supposed to make me happy? Yep, take pride in the fact that thanks to you, people like me shine even more. Oh, that's a compliment. Huh? 
Kashina said that you were a complete moron. <laughs> okay, anyways, we're done. <laughs> okay, no one went off. It's it's time to go. Yep, okay, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.